multimodal interface for the Diamond Touch. And uh, one of the capabilities that we can do with speech is to navigate to particular locations. So, fly to Chicago. And here in this application, you can see that I'm now relocating to Chicago, where I have pin marked a number of different crimes, in particular automobile thefts. And we're going to look at this particular crime, case number HL442785. It's a vehicle theft that happened just outside a medical slash dental office. And here's the date and uh, different information like the police district and the police beat. So let me close this information. One thing that we can do with this interface is overlay uh, different types of information. So uh, let me start by layer bars. And here in this application, you can see that we are in a bar centric area. You can see the number of bars uh, in this area is quite high. So we are in a bar centric area. This is downtown Chicago. So let me zoom in again and let's try a different layer to see if we can get some more information. So what we know about the crime so far is that there's many bars that it could be around. So these would be good places to see. Undo layer, layer, banks. So we wanted to know if maybe somebody had robbed a bank and then stolen a vehicle just around uh, the bank robbery. And you can see that there's a city bank nearby, a SunTrust bank, and a U.S. bank or uh, but nothing immediately around this area. So let's look at something else. Undo layer, layer, lodging. Okay, so here what we find is a little bit of interesting information in that we are, this particular vehicle theft is right beside the intercontinental Chicago. So this is a place that, you know, probably has very expensive cars running through uh, the like possibly somebody impersonated a valet, stole the vehicle, and made off with it. So we have a little bit more information about what's going on here. And in addition, uh, I'll show you one more layer. Undo layer, layer, buildings, navigation panel. And as you can see here, I can tilt the space to show the three-dimensional buildings. Uh, as you can with Google Earth. So, and that is the end of the demo.